You must be well pleased with yourself. Taking advantage of Vinny's situation like that. I'm giving him above the asking price, so he's actually coming out of this very well. It's worth paying a few extra pennies to look after family. <laughs> You're not family. Everything all right? Yeah, I've just come to pick up the rest of my stuff. Thanks for holding on to it for me. OK, why? He's convinced Vinny to sell mill quarters to him. We're going to be neighbours. No, you're not. Just take your junk, stick it in your car and don't come back. Look, all right? And on an art, I want us to be friends, all of us. I know I broke the trust and I need to fix it. That's why I'm sticking around. And why would I believe a single word that comes out of your mouth? Because it's meant everything to me, getting to know you. Getting to know my sister and learning about our mum. All you need to know is that her giving you up was the best thing she ever did. So is this the same mum that you didn't want anything to do with? OK, Lev. No, no, no. You know, I don't know how you can live with yourself, knowing you wasted the last years of her life pushing her away. You were wishing her dead. No, hey, hey! No, no! <sighs> Caleb, look, it'll be better for everyone if you just leave. If you don't, I'll kill you, and I mean it. I'll see it! I mean, even Kyle had to step in to save you from Big Nasty Al. Oh, oh no, 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 no! Right, come on, then! Come on, let's see what you've got! Shut up! I mean, what the hell is going to you? What does it they say? Bad blood, Willow! Come on, we're leaving! Yeah, that's it, listen to the wifey. We all know she's got bigger balls than you. No, come on, Ken. Don't. This village, yeah? It's my home now. Do you hear me? I'm staying. <laughs>